I can't. You can't order me around. Not after what happened with Claudia. Stop talking. Look, I proved myself and you know it, so back off. You guys all right? You can skip the whole good cop, good cousin routine because I'm not going to tell you anything about Claudia. I, I didn't ask. But I have to wonder if anyone's telling you to keep quiet about what happened to Claudia. Michael was at the Metro Court when Claudia took Carly hostage. He was just still a little upset. Oh, yeah, he came into the house and started harassing Mom. I wasn't harassing her, Michael. I'm just trying to find out what happened. When you're ready to discuss it, just let me know, okay? Why would I tell okay, you that's, anything? that's enough. Look, you had no right to come into the house and harass my mom and start questioning her. You should have seen him. He was acting all concerned because we're related. If you had any respect for family, you wouldn't be a cop and you would have never went against your own father. Okay. You know what? Look, go get in the car. You're no. a traitor to your family, so you better stop following me around because I am never going to tell you car. anything. Get in the car now! I didn't follow him over here, Jason. I know. But whatever it is that's bothering him, it's getting worse. Yeah, it's a tough situation. He's just trying to work his way through it right now. I feel like I understand what he's going through to a certain degree. When my dad's life actually works, I had to figure out how to fit in. I mean, you were there. You saw how difficult it was for me once I couldn't idolize him anymore. Michael still admires Sonny. I know, but at some point, he's going to have to make a choice like I did. He can either get tangled up in his father's life or he can save himself. I know, he just needs some time, that's all. Well, he also needs to talk about what happened the night Claudia died. He admitted she's dead, by the way. He slipped up. Is that going to be on your official report? Whatever he's trying to hide, Jason, it's tearing him up inside. All right, it's not too late to save him, but the way he's going, you're gonna have to move fast. What happened? Oh my God, are you okay? Well, will you get off my back for one hey, second? Hey. Michael was at Jake's. Coleman called me, and when I got there, he was giving attitude to Lucky. Look, I don't care if Lucky's my cousin. He's a cop. Did he say anything to Lucky? No, Mom, I'm right here, and no, I did not say hey, anything hey, to hey, Lucky. Hey, hey, you need to settle down, Michael. No, you need to stop giving me orders. I took care of it, just like you and Dad were going to, so you all need to get off my back. Sit down. Not gonna happen. Sit. I'm going to say this once. So you better listen. What you did tonight was stupid. You had no business in Jake's. You told me you were going to the library to study for And you lied to your mother again, and the way you were talking to Lucky puts us all Lucky at Lucky was right in if my you face. you keep talking, Michael... He's gonna figure it out. He's already close. I'm not gonna let Lucky, who turns back on Shut up! You keep saying that you're a man, that you want to live on your own, but you're acting like a little bitch! Like all those other rich kids who have no respect for anything or anyone. Quit disrespecting the people who are trying to protect you. I mean, you look like an idiot. At Jake's talking to Lucky like that. I was embarrassed for you, man. I still am. You know what the problem is? That we've spoiled you for so many years. Me. Most of all. Well, I'm done. From now on, keep your mouth shut. Show some respect. Go to school. If you don't, I'll make you. Now apologize to your mother. Stand up! I'm sorry, Mom. I get that I messed up at Jake's. It won't happen again. You've never had any use for cops, so why should I? Sorry, Carly, 
I failed you. And I failed him. I, I don't even know where to start to fix this. I'm his mom. It's on me to get that kid under control before he gets in any more trouble. 